Hello viewers, welcome to Kaitoil channel. Today in our channel, we are going to see this crochet spin wheel flask. See, if it is looking like a spin wheels. See, you can do it with a woolen thread. I have made with cotton thread also. So you can use whatever your choice. For this, I am using woolen thread. And then smaller mm, 2 mm says crochet needle. So come, let's start it. It's a very easy pattern for the beginners. You can do it in a minutes in just two three minutes okay first make a slip knot see so another time show you first make a slip knot like this and then do six chains one two three four five and then six six chains and then slip stitch at the first chain here okay and then for the next round for the first round you have to make three chains and then do we have to do double crochet so yarn over the needle insert the needle inside the ring See here and then yarn over it, pull through this, there will be three loops present, yarn over it, leave the two loops, again yarn over it and then leave the two loops. Okay, that is the double crochet, you have to do it another time. So consider that uh, three chains is a double crochet, so you will have three double crochets like that. Okay, then one chain and then you have to make three double crochets inside the ring. See, first double crochet, second, then third, and then make one chain. Okay, see, I have done two sets now. I have to make three more sets, so totally I will be having five sets. Okay, like this. We are at the end of the fifth set. Make one chain and then slip stitch at the top of the chain. See that three double crochet and one chain set. See, I'll be having five set three, four, five. Okay. Now for the spin wheel type, make four chains. One, two, three, four, and then double crochets in the fourth chain okay so you have to make five double crochets in the same stitch see one two three four And then five okay see five times I have done the double crochets and then you have to slip stitch in the first chain space okay the previous round so another time I'll show you again start with four chain one two three four and then in the fourth chain do five double crochets like this the same fourth chain you have to do five double crochets three four five and then you have to slip stitch at the chain space okay so like this you have to do three more times so that you will be having five petals now. Now slip stitch at the last chain space. See that's it. You have to cut off the excess yarn and then finish off it. Trim the excess in the flower itself. See you will be having five 
petals. See, viewers, I have finished my spin wheel flowers. See how it's looking beautifully. So you can do it within uh, just 2-3 uh, minutes. Okay. So it's a very useful flower. You can use it in a small designs also. I hope you all will like this video. There are further more easy videos for the beginners available in my channel. For that, I want you to like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.